guys, we've just checked in to our hotel. We're currently in Gran Canaria on a little holiday. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a little room tour. So this is the bathroom, which is lush. This is what it looks like. We've got some little robes, which I'm all here for. And also the slippers. I feel like this is when you know that you're in like a bougie hotel. We are all inclusive, hence the little band that I have on. But yeah, so this is the bathroom. The reason I'm showing you this now is so then I don't then forget and then have to phone the room door when everything's messy. Like everything is clean, everything's tidy. So I'm gonna do it now. So yeah, this was the bathroom. And then you come out here. Here is my suitcase, which is actually broken. <laughs> we got it from the plane and it was broken. Yeah, Jet 2, I don't know what you've been doing with my suitcase, but that is not ideal really. So I'm gonna have to get a new case when I go home. And I don't even know what I'm gonna be able to do with that. I'm gonna have to probably get it wrapped when I go to the airport on the way home so I can get it home in one piece. So we've got some little chairs here. We've got Harvey sat in like the living room area. Some cute little decor. <laughs> These are looking good. <laughs> really? Are you sure? <laughs> um, got some cute little decor. We've got a TV. Harvey, do you want to show them what the TV does? Guys, look at this. Three. <laughs> I <laughs> did it the wrong way. The TV turns all the way around. Yeah, so then it's into the bedroom. We have actually got two single beds. I think, we, I don't think they really realized that it was a couple, um, but you know, personal space. We've got a little mirror here, like a full length mirror, which is great. And then we've got a wardrobe space over here. We also have like a safe and like a drawer and stuff. And one thing about this hotel is they actually have like loads of little like boxes of stuff. So like this is a sewing kit and shoe shine. But then in the bathroom, they had like a razor, they had like a comb, obviously like your shampoo and conditioner and stuff like that, which again, I feel like you can just tell it is like a bougie place to stay. And then we've got two little sun lounges on our balcony, two chairs, and then this is our gorgeous view. So there is actually three pools in this hotel, which is incredible. So this one is for like the royal level, which is where we're actually staying. So it's only people on the royal level that can go to that pool. Um, same with like the restaurant and bars that are over there. I know it's kind of hard to see right now, but you'll get a better glimpse when like we're down and out. Um, but then like this pool, anyone can use and same with the other one. And I don't know if you can see, but there's like a stage and um, there's a CrossFit section. Like they have so much here. So we're gonna go ahead and get dressed for the day and by get dressed I mean put a bikini on I think today we're just going to sort of chill by the hotel catch a nice tan and just see like what we can get up to whilst we're here probably go in the pool and stuff like that and I'm going to take loads of like content on my Instagram and stuff like that so if you haven't seen that then definitely check it out but we are staying in the Barcelo Margaritas Hotel in Gran Canaria so I'll put it on the screen in case anybody is wondering um but I also do have a discount code tell them in 10 and you'll get 10% off <laughs> They've started the entertainment. <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> if my mum was here, she would be joining in. This is her thing. <laughs> so we've come to you at the pool. This is what it looks like. Try not to get other people in it. But wow. It's so hot, we've already been in. How are you feeling, how Quite cool now. Quite cool, yeah. It's very, very nice. We're gonna get a drink in a second. We didn't expect it to be this warm when we were looking at the weather on the way here. We were looking at it and it was like 20 degrees, but the actual part in which we're staying, it's a lot hotter, we're more down south. We're currently walking to the bar to go and get another drink, because it's super hot. I've got my crocs on. Also got Harvey's hat on because of my head. It's burning. But this is where we had breakfast this morning. Super cute. They even have a little ice cream machine. I feel like Harvey's gonna make so much use out of that. Because he I loves like ice it. cream. Even got little like ice like lollies in here as well. How cute. Got my drink. I got a strawberry mojito. And Harvey got a strawberry daiquiri. Guessed it. Yeah. The cup looks nicer than mine though. My cup? Yeah, uh, yeah yours just is have... just plain, isn't it? But I haven't tested it yet, so we don't know, but it did look like it had a lot of alcohol in it, which I'm not complaining about, but for my first drink, it could be a little bit strong. 
So we shall see. Right guys, ignore how atrocious I look in this hat, but I'm gonna do a taste test to see if it's really strong. Yeah, that's actually really nice. Mm. That's really nice. It was good. That is quite good, yeah. It's not as strong as I thought it's taste. Mm. This is what the pool looks like. The people in front of us have just disappeared, so I can show you guys a little bit better without getting them in. But it's so nice, so hot, the sun's literally right above us. Oh, you! Yeah. <laughs> Quite nice. <laughs> I normally land mojitos. You know, a flavoured mojito is nice. Yeah, Plain mojito is not. I tasted your other mojitos. And the the passion fruit really. one you liked. Not. When we went to Portugal. That's a lot nicer, this one. That one. It's just like strawberry lemonade. Mmm, it's good. <laughs> you have to get one the next time. Can you take it back? So it's a little while later, it's about three o'clock and we've come for food. So we've got some balbon and also a chicken and cheese quesadilla. We're both going to share the two. Um, how delicious do they look? Harvey's eager to eat. He's like, come on, stop filming, go on. <laughs> Do us a taste test. Good. Quite good. Guys, it's been some time since our last vlog. So we've got ready for the evening and we're just about to pop open a bottle of champagne, which we actually got given this morning when we checked into the room. But obviously we were out at the pool all day, so we haven't actually drank it yet. So we're gonna drink some of that before we go and take some pictures of me, Harvey's favorite job in the world. <laughs> so this is my outfit. It's kind of hard to show you because the bed's really close to the mirror, but I've just got this white, like off-white cream dress on from Mars the Label. And then I've got these shoes on from Aloha's and then we've got a Vivian Westwood bag to match it. So, well, to match the shoes, not the dress. <laughs> Fucking hell, that made me <laughs> How loud was that? That was so loud. Oh, a little bit of the bubbly. Oh, a little bit of the bubbly. Ooh, a little bit of the bubbly. Oh, she is bubbly. Whoa, whoa, almost. <laughs> Bubbles. Cheers. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. <laughs> Thank you very much. Cheers. I genuinely cannot even explain this dessert planet. Right? <laughs> we've got artificial watermelon and real watermelon. And we've got melon, pineapple and some fizzy gummy bears. I do feel like a big kid right now. And I still am a big kid, so that's okay. We'll begin. Woo! I can begin to know we touching you. Good morning, guys. It is now the next day. So we've got up, got dressed, got ready and we're gonna head to the pool and also head for some food because it's breakfast time we're both hungry i'm gonna try and get an outfit picture before i eat though because i blow like crazy i actually think i must be intolerant to something so i'm gonna try and get my picture before i blow um but we shall see how that goes <laughs> got myself a little breakfast so we've got scrambled egg hash browns sausage beans and then this is a roasted tomato and then got some orange juice. Harvey's pretty much got the same, but he's got fried egg and bacon. <laughs> These are to heat in. Hash browns are too good. Yeah, the hash browns here slap. They're it's like the best hash browns. Oh yeah, you got three hash browns, didn't you? Oh, he's already eaten one. I thought he had two, but he had three. Guys, it's been some time. Oh, my little strap is blowing in the wind, but we're just heading off on a little walk into like town, maybe towards like the beach. I'm not really too sure, but we just thought we'd get out the hotel for a little bit because we obviously spent all day yesterday just by the pool. So we figured it might be nice to actually see a bit of Massapalomas whilst we're here. Um, apparently though, I got told yesterday that this is the gay capital of Gran Canaria. And that would make sense because last night when we were looking at bars and places to go, a lot of them were like, what's the word? OG. No, no. they were, what's the word? <laughs> with like something labelled. Is that the word? 
when you go on like maps, it came up and it said it was an LGBTQ plus bar. It didn't just say it was a normal bar. I feel like that makes sense if this is the gay capital, but I don't really know how true that is. That's just what I got told yesterday. It's very, very warm today. We have caught a little bit more sun whilst we've been laying on the little barley beds. That's what they call them here. I feel like they're just more like day beds really, aren't yeah, they? I but I guess it's because you get them in like your barley beach clubs and stuff like that. I think we want to cross over. Would well, you not want to cross on the crossing? No, he just wants to make room for it. Guys, I've got to put up with this for six months. Just us, on our own. He, I could end up dead. What do you have to say for yourself? Just being tam fishing. <laughs> we just went into the shop and got these to try, which look really nice. They actually come in their own, like, individual wrapper. Harvey's already eating his, shock. How is it? Oh. Good. You only get six, but we figured we're probably going to eat them quite quickly because it is super hot and we don't want them to melt. But we just wanted a little snack for our walk. So guys, it's now the evening and we've got ready, got dressed, all that jazz. So I'm doing my little OOTN. I have been doing my outfit of the nights and outfit of the days on my TikTok. So this is the dress that I'm wearing this evening. It's from Ego, it's a little crochet dress. And then I've got my little Balenciaga bag and we just lower it. And then I've got Primark wedges on, which are gold. And yeah, that's my outfit. My camera battery's about to die. Um, but I think I'm gonna have to vlog the rest of the evening on my phone because I've got such a small bag it won't fit in there um so i'm just gonna take my phone and then that way i'll carry my phone i can't carry my phone and my camera so we're gonna go for some food shortly we're gonna go take some pictures and yeah see what the night has to hold so i completely forgot to vlog food because obviously i didn't have my camera but we got the same wine as last night i also got harvey to take some pictures of me which he was very embarrassed so, doing because i had to get my light out whereas a lot of the other pictures i've been taking around I haven't really had to use my light because it obviously is still quite light outside but we had a yummy meal and yeah like i said we're just drinking this wine and then we're going to go over to the other area for the entertainment again we're hoping there's entertainment tonight we haven't heard anything yet but we think it starts at nine i got another strawberry mojito it's in a big glass tonight because it's obviously not full if they didn't actually have strawberry last night they had mango and the mango one was really good but strawberry just tastes like strawberry lemonade it's great <laughs> Right, basically you guys, we've been playing a Ring of Fire for ages. This is Will and this is Lulu. So it's now the next day. We've got to put our bikini and swimming shorts on and we're going to head down to the pool and chill on the barley beds. We drank a lot more last night than what we anticipated and we actually didn't get in till 2am. Despite the hotel's like bar closing at 12, we actually walked with two people that we met to go to a club. <laughs> which then wasn't there. So we ended up then just coming back. But yeah, so it was about 2 a.m. when we got in last night. So we are very tired, but we did sleep in a little bit longer. No, actually we didn't sleep in any longer. We just haven't left the room. Yeah. Yeah, I've just realized that. We got up at nine, like we have been doing for the past few days. Um, but we just haven't left the room yet and it's nearly 11 o'clock. It's just been a very slow morning this morning because we're both not feeling 100%. I think it's the lack of sleep and obviously the alcohol as well, like I've got a little bit of a headache. But we're going to go chill on the barley beds and probably sleep some more, have some food. And yeah, it's just going to be another day at the hotel really. Like the whole purpose of us coming to this hotel is kind of just to stay here because it is all inclusive. So the hotel have actually just set up a barley bed for us. <laughs> Nobody else is allowed into this section today because we're in here. <laughs> I feel so bad. And then they've got us a little fruit platter, which looks absolutely incredible. And then we also have some champagne. So our glasses just currently resting on there whilst we're taking pictures of the fruit and everything. So we've come for some lunch. The hotel actually has like an a la carte menu during lunchtime. So we didn't eat breakfast this morning, obviously, because we got wet. So now we can indulge in the really nice food. Because obviously for breakfast and tea, it's like buffet food, um, which is all really nice as well. But I've been craving like a big bowl of pasta. So I got some pesto pasta. Harvey got a chicken burger, which looks incredible. What sauce is it? Is that cheese sauce? Yeah. Mmm, it looks so good. Them chips as well. Guys, 
guys, it has come to the time where we're now leaving, which I'm really sad about. I haven't actually vlogged anything today because we've literally done absolutely nothing. Originally, we were supposed to check out the hotel at 12, but then obviously with us not having a flight until later on in the evening, we asked if we could like have a later check out. And when we asked the night before, the man was sort of unsure. So we were like, we don't want to get our hopes up just in case we can't. So we sort of took the most out of the time that we thought we had and just sort of stayed in bed till like 11 and then packed up all our stuff. When we eventually went down to ask, they obviously said that we could stay in the room. So we kind of wasted a bit of the morning just doing that. But at the same time, we did really need to catch up on some sleep. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and head to the airport now. I don't know how well this is going to go because my suitcase currently has three wheels. I don't know if I mentioned, but Jet 2 actually destroyed my suitcase on the way here. Um, but yeah, so saying goodbye to the room. Have you sad to leave? Yeah, back yeah, to work. Back to normality. We've had a really fun few days of literally just doing nothing but chilling by the pool, drinking, eating, all that good stuff. But yeah, that is going to be it for the vlog. And I will speak to you guys soon, probably when I'm on an all holiday in Zante. If you guys are interested in staying in this hotel or any of the Barcelona group hotels, they have actually given me a discount code, which is really nice of them. The discount code is only valid till July 16th this year. So that's 2023. And it will save you 10% off. So my discount code is Jasmine10 and it'll save you 10% off your booking. Any of the Barcelona hotels, they all have a very similar vibe, similar like aesthetics and stuff like that but they're obviously dotted all around the world so if you are interested save yourself some money and use my discount code and um, we've loved our stay here and i definitely want to come back or to like another hotel of the group we're gonna love you guys and leave you and like i said i will probably see you next week in zanti because i literally fly on sunday <laughs> so it's back home unpacking and then packing again and i need to do something about suitcase because Mine's now broken.